How you doing? <laughs> Hello. That's <laughs> so cute. This is. Oh, okay. Bye. We ended up in a vegan diner. Everything is vegan, so they don't have eggs, they don't have cheese. Well, they have, but it's eggs, it's cheese. There's ham, which is ham, made from probably gluten and what? Uh, I don't know. I don't know what else they're made of, but it looks pretty good. If we just arrive and look, it's really huge. And come on, how did you can eat? What is that? This is salad. Why are you eating salad? So I can be hungry to eat meat. <laughs> and look, pancakes look really good. Yeah. It's just weird that there's a small one and then a big one under it. Mama and it's for design. <laughs> and there's a sausage here, which is not really sausage. It's sausage made of whatever. But okay, let's dig in. It looks really good. We're gonna have an insatiable desire to tell everyone that we ate vegan. <laughs> Even the milk is vegan. I can't believe it, it's actually really good. I ordered this thing called the hangover hash brown, so it's just really potatoes scrambled in with broccoli and vegan sausages and jalapeno and um, sour cream, which I don't know what it's made of. And there's cheddar cheese, which obviously is not cheese because it's vegan. So it's really making me wonder what it is. <laughs> so we're here right now in the Brooklyn Bridge, by the Brooklyn Bridge, and there you go. It's a bridge. Good job. Good job. <laughs> oh, nah. <laughs> we're gonna get on the bridge and just walk. I don't know, have fun? Is it fun walking on the bridge? <laughs> Let's go with fellow tourists. Come on, let's go. One girl cookies. Wow. Such artist. Very creative. We weren't planning to see the Statue of Liberty, but at least we can see it from here. So yeah, it's over there. If you see that tiny thing, that's the Statue of Liberty. At least we got to see it, even from this distance. Yeah! The Statue of Freedom! Can we uh, take a picture? A picture? No, let's go. Is it too small? It's too small, it can't be seen. <laughs> let's put it in a big arrow. <laughs> <laughs> we saw the Statue of Liberty right there! Boom! Big arrow! Okay, now we see the Empire State Building. It's this small one over here. Wow, we get to see lots of stuff here on the Brooklyn Bridge. No wonder why it's so famous. You get to see the Statue of Liberty here, the Empire State Building here. <laughs> Although they're just this small, at least I gotta see it. It's better than not seeing it at all. We successfully crossed the Brooklyn Bridge by foot from end to end. And we are pretty much at the other end now. It was fun, but it was very tiring because it was super, super, super hot. Good thing I didn't wear a jacket and I had to take off my scarf. Wow, modal. Come on, modal, modal. Modal. Central Park Zoo. Looking at sea lions. Where's the sea lion? Come here, come here, sea lion. <laughs> Hello. How you doing? <laughs> Hello. That's so cute, this is... Oh, okay, bye. Do it again, do it again. One time. So majestic. One more time. Look at this guy. Come on, come at me, bro. Help me. Help me get out of here. They've kidnapped my family. I must get back to them. Please, sir. Please. I must get back to them at my earliest convenience. You see a red panda. It is nothing like a panda. Over here, we can see the Mac OS X snow leopard in its natural habitat. Not natural, natural habitat. It's positively smashing. Shh. It'll be over soon. As you can see over here, they don't like to move it, move it. Damn. Yeah. Oh, Lemon yeah. chicken over rice. The Six best bucks. budget meals in New York. Six man. dollars. Six dollars. Mmm. Yeah, buddy.
Okay, right now we are in the subway. Because it's rush hour, it feels just like home, see? The MRT. <laughs> How are you doing? Yeah, tired? Tired? Yeah, we walked around New York and our feet are tired. Our feet hurt. We're going back to the Airbnb now and rest for a bit. Bye. <laughs> yeah, see you. Boom. Aww. See you in the Philippines. Woo. Yeah, let me know um, how your trip goes. Yeah. Um, keep me updated. Okay? All right. So we were on the way to the airport, and as you can see here, it says in our ticket, main terminal, right? Main terminal. So we were wondering what the main terminal was, and the taxi driver asked us, "What's the main terminal? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, or eight? And so we don't know. And what we did was, while the taxi was on the way. To whatever terminal we called the customer service of Philippine Airlines, the heart of the Filipino. The customer service representative was like, "Oh, okay. Um, let me check." And it took her forever. And then she says, "Okay, ma'am, it is Terminal Five." And then she didn't even seem sure, so she checked again. Uh, wait a mo wait a moment, ma'am. I'll check again. And then when she finally said, "Yes, it says here Terminal Five. Okay, we went to Terminal Five. When we got to Terminal Five, it wasn't Terminal Five. The guy there said. No, there are no planes here. Airplanes only. Yeah, they don't even fly international flights. So the guy um, directed us to Terminal One, which where which is where the Philippine Airlines is. So we're like wondering what is happening with Philippine Airlines. What, where did they get the information that it's Terminal Five? I mean, is it saying the computer is Terminal Five when it's clearly not Terminal Five? So now we're rushing to Terminal One. We're almost late for our flight. If it's Terminal 1, why didn't they even say so here? Why did they have to put ter main terminal? A lot of people could miss their flight because of these kinds of problems. So please, get these things straight. It's very frustrating. So we're in the train right now and the directory says that Philippine Airlines is Terminal 1. Ah, can't believe they would tell us that it's Terminal 5 when it's clearly not. We're on the plane now and we're about to leave. I think Maria is sleeping. We're about to leave New York. And it was a fun trip. We are about to go back to Manila and back to reality. So when we get back, we won't be vlogging every day, but we'll be vlogging once a week. Um, and other fun challenges or whatever cutesy stuff we can think of, we'll see. But we'll be definitely posting once a week. And yeah, I can't wait to get back to Manila. See you soon guys and yeah, thanks for watching. See ya! If we haven't tried McDonald's yet by the end of this trip, please let us know in the comments below what's the difference of McDonald's here in the US and McDonald's in the Philippines? 